Hello, my name is Andre Gerber, and I am from Stellenbosch University's Drama Department. So the actor William Defoe said that great theater is about challenging how we think and encouraging us to imagine a world that we aspire to. So if you decide to study drama, you will learn how to challenge, how to think, how to imagine, and how to create a better world through theater. Salabash University's drama department is a student-focused learning environment where you will learn to create moving, important, and of course, captivating theater, both in front of and behind the scenes. So if you study drama at Stellenbosch, you will have the choice between two main streams. So the one is performance, and the other one is technical and management training. There are also several theoretical components, which I will briefly discuss a bit later. So in the performance stream, you will learn, develop, and refine your acting, voice, and movement skills. Oh, sorry. Of course, the performance stream is not just limited to uh, acting. You will also develop your skills in physical theater, in radio performance, in screen acting, writing, as well as directing. So our course is based in the performance stream on the development of three fundamental skills. So the one is acting, the other one is movement, and of course the final one is voice. And I will go through each of them uh, individually. So in acting, you will learn various approaches to creating a character and maintaining performance on stage. You will have the opportunity to perform in several genres, from comedy to drama. You will also uh, perform in a range of styles, uh, everything from Shakespeare to realism. And we will, of course, teach you various approaches to constructing a character from the outside in and the inside out. Our course also provides students with the opportunity to practice screen acting. Our focus, however, does remain on uh, theater acting. The next one is movement. So movement training provides you with the tools and opportunities to liberate your body from habitual psychophysical patterns, including poor posture, ineffective alignment, and limited dynamic and expressive range. So throughout the course, we use improvisation as the foundational strategy to explore and refine movement techniques and choreographic approaches. So movement training, of course, not only provides technical and choreographic skills necessary for performance, but it also hones skills such as uh, collaboration, facilitation, uh, empathy for others, and of course, ensemble work. And of course, finally, we have voice. Uh, and in our department, this aims to develop your voice in a holistic and a creative manner. We want you to be confident, comfortable, and clear in both English and Afrikaans performances. Uh, we are very language friendly. We encourage bilingualism, and we are understanding about where you come from as a speaker. So we work on your skills, such as expanding the breath, uh, developing your range, and finding strength and clarity in sounds. We also work on a variety of poetry, prose, and monologue texts, and play with vocal improvisations. Uh, and of course, in the accents course, uh, in the second year, we further develop your versatility as a performer. So we want you to be uh, energetic, confident, and sensitive as expressive speakers. Of course, besides these three streams, we also have other skills and practices that you will develop during your three years. Uh, and of course, if you want to, you can specialize in one of these in your fourth year, should you choose to do an honors degree. So these skills are directing, cabaret, puppetry, children's theater, speech and voice, radio, writing, physical theater, uh, applied theater, and of course you can if you want to specialize in acting as well. So that's it for the performance stream. So the other stream that runs concurrently is the technical and management stream. So in this stream, you will be taught a wide variety of skills such as um, design, props, decor, costumes, uh, sound and lighting. So 
along with these various other classes, we supplement your course so that you are well-rounded as a technician uh, to go into theater and, of course, um, television, if you should so choose. So uh, this is split into the following. So we have stage and production management. So here we focus on planning and managing a production. You will gain a thorough knowledge of stage management theory, and you can apply this knowledge as a stage manager during the course. You will also learn how to analyze a text, plan, budget for production, and of course, the constant problem solving from pre-production all the way, of course, through to post-production. Next, you will learn design, which forms an integral part of the theater. You will have a thorough knowledge of the role of a designer as well as the design process, and of course, be given the opportunity to apply it uh, in productions. You will also explore various styles and periods ranging from the art and craft movement to postmodernism. Then in Daquan Props, you will be exposed to the basic materials, tools, techniques using decor, prop, and mask construction. We will teach you how to execute a prop, a set piece, or a mask, all the way from the planning phase to the final product uh, using, for example, sculpting, molding, uh, fiberglass, and uh, other tools and materials. And then, of course, we have makeup. So makeup training teaches you the design and application techniques of stage makeup. Uh, so we include straight makeup for men and women, aging makeup, and all the way to fantasy makeup. Uh, you will be equipped to apply and design uh, your own makeup for theatrical productions. And then, of course, we have costumes. So here you will learn the complete process of the construction of a piece of clothing. So the training equips you with the necessary knowledge of basic sewing skills and the principles which can be used to make change or uh, maintain a costume. You will gain practical experience from concept formation to the design and of course all the way through to the final product. Then finally, uh, during your classes in the technical stream, you will uh, be prepared for the sound, lighting, and video requirements of uh, the technical theater environment. So these elements include understanding sound, lighting, video principles, setting up a PA system, uh, operating an analog sound desk, a Q-Lab, sound editing, rigging, focusing lights, uh, operating a lighting desk, uh, and executing a lighting design. So during your second and third year of study, you will, of course, be introduced to video production and editing. So these are the two streams that you can choose to follow if you study drama. So, of course, just a reminder, the one is the technical stream and the other is the performance stream. Both the technical and performance students need to do theory modules, uh, and you can complete... Uh, there are various components that you can do within drama theory, but in all of them, you will learn the history of drama and theatre internationally, as well as, of course, in South Africa, the workings of the South African theatre industry, uh, styles and approaches to theatre making, the philosophy of drama and performance, and the analysis of texts and their contexts. Uh, before we continue, I just want to make uh, note of the fact that you will uh, also need to do BA modules, such as the language, English, Afrikaans, or Isikosa, uh, but this will be explained in the uh, yearbook. So we also do productions at the drama department. So we try to do four productions per year, but these numbers, they, you know, they, they uh, change depending on the students that we have and the educational opportunities that, uh, that are available. So we usually do everything from classical theater, to Shakespeare, to the avant-garde, to realistic theater, uh, physical theater or dance theater. And we also do a yearly children's production that is, of course, very, very popular. Then also at the bottom, we have the premier theater festival. So this is one of the most exciting aspects. If you study drama specifically at Stellenbosch, you are encouraged to create your own plays. Uh, we host an annual theater competition and uh, both performance and technical students can take part uh, in this competition where you are encouraged to create completely new uh, plays. 
Uh, some of the players, including the winning production, are then given a professional run at uh, the local arts festival, the Wurtwees. And uh, there are also many, many prizes for grabs, and many of our students create a name for themselves in the industry by participating in this festival. I also want to note that our two winning productions for the past two years have now also been uh, made into movies for CakeNet. So just some final thoughts. Um, in terms of the language of the department, we are totally uh, bilingual and we do encourage you to work in at least two languages. So the main languages, of course, English and Afrikaans, but, uh, and, and these are the languages in which you will do your practical as well as your theoretical work. And you can choose to work either in one or the other or in both. Uh, we're also in the process of introducing new uh, languages to the course. Uh, and of course, when you do productions for Premiere, you can work in any language that you prefer. Then also you do not need to have uh, dramatic subjects, uh, dramatic art, as a subject, as a school subject. Uh, but of course, it is very helpful if you did have it, but it is totally not necessary. And then finally, you must uh, complete an audition uh, if you want to do the performance stream, as well as an interview if you want to do the technical stream. So the information for uh, this edition will be provided to you on the webpage, as well as through the undergraduate course coordinator. And you can contact the undergraduate course coordinator, Dr. Scott van Merwe, at uh, the email address uh, on your screen. And that is it from my side. And uh, thank you so much for taking the time to listen.